Now, watching back the beginning of the fight made me think that I probably should go see an eye doctor soon because I don't know why I thought Ancient Dragon's Lightning Strike would be the move here, but at least it did some damage to Nile. Two things to note here. One, I don't know how the hell that Lightning didn't register Nile's Hurt Box. And two, I really think Nile might be a boss that I definitely have conquered, dare say master at this point. Once you eliminate his Spirit Lackeys, he is like so predictable and easy. I guess one thing I have to say is that this boss is always going to be fairly simple if you have ways to counter him from range. But even if you have a melee focus build, I mean, there's only like a couple of attacks that you even really have to worry about. Now take this clip here for example. The easiest attack to punish is when he leaps like a salmon into the air. You just have to make sure you don't get caught by his little backhanded spear attack right there. I mean, after that, this battle is pretty much just rinse and repeat. I just baited out some of those attacks, watched Nile get caught in the Matrix for a second there, and then I found little windows to get some damage off while Nile was beginning an attack animation. I think even Stevie Wonder could see how this battle was going to turn out, so I'll just cut to the chase for all of you so you can get back to watching the NBA playoffs or 